Welcome to Meditations with Stony. Find a comfortable position in a chair or on a pillow on the floor in a field of grass surrounded by mosquitoes because it is still August in Middle Tennessee. I really don't give a shit where. Just wherever you're comfortable in this loving, accepting, meditative football moment. If you're joining me today, you've been through the mental and emotional grind of the NFL offseason. You've listened to podcasts, radio, TV talking heads. You've scrolled through social media as talk about meaningless preseason rankings, anticipated win-loss records, who's stopping this offense posts, and predictions of draft busts fill you with anxiety and sometimes rage all in anticipation of the NFL season. Take a deep cleansing breath and fully absorb the reality of the moment that the preseason is here. And to quote the great Braden Gall of a football show, football people are doing football things on a football field. Sense the sights, the sounds, the feelings that indicate training camp has begun. It's hotter than sex in a tiny room with no air conditioning. Allow yourself to feel that heat. Notice the lingering aftertaste of alcohol you've consumed to cope with the stress of the off-season, the lack of real information, the national media members who don't know shit about your team predicting a four-win season. Notice all your senses, including the boiling blood running through your veins, as you think of the petty, dumbass haters on social media who don't know ball but have the strongest takes. Stealing your hope and joy, proclaiming that your favorite draft pick will be a massive disappointment after one day of training camp. One fucking day. <clears throat> Allow yourself to feel the excitement and energy from the anticipated season draining from your body. Your thoughts turn to the horror of last year's difficult season. The injuries, the Swiss cheese offensive line play, the predictable play calling, the empty promises to coach better, play better. Taste the bile gurgling up as you begin to throw up in your mouth. Accept these thoughts and sensations as part of the natural process of fandom anxiety. The swirling of partial information in your mind, combined with the passion for your team, has turned your brain into a shitstorm. Jumping to illogical conclusions before a single snap of the regular season. At this point in your meditation, Listen to Stony. Don't be a jabroni. Imagine all the negativity about the upcoming season and the haters floating gently onto a football in your hands. And with exceeding force, punt those motherfuckers deep into space. Just don't, don't pull a quad as... Yeah, tend to put a damper on this meditation. As the bad thoughts 
sail out of sight relax smile knowing that your team has potential the great unknown and the hope that lies in overcoming adversity and possibility is the beauty of sports notice the sweet smell of victory in spite of any negative distraction or the disgusting taste in your mouth pleasant thoughts of tailgates watch parties celebrating touchdowns with friends as you focus your mind on enjoying the NFL season there is nothing like this great sport feel the goosebumps rising on your arms in anticipation of a fun-filled season when the leaves turn and a chill graces the air have a wonderful football day and thank you for practicing another meditation with stoning